Okay, um, I wanted to ask you about the uh, how did the launch uh, go in uh, of the Threat Ripper? Um, it's been a great launch. Uh, it was great to take the performance crown and really deliver the highest uh, computing power on the market uh, with the high end desktop. And the Thread Ripper really provides a platform that we think is going to be great for consumers, great for prosumers, great for people that are gaming and building content. Um, so we think it's a great thing for the industry to have Thread Ripper out in the market. Okay, again, uh, what is the Thread Ripper advantage uh, for a gamer? Um, for gamers, we think it's really about what you can do while you're gaming and doing all the other things that are really common now. So whether you're gaming and streaming, um, whether you've got clips and highlights that you want to uh, compress and you want to edit, um, while you're delivering that gaming experience, Threadripper allows you to do that all in one box without having a separate uh, computer to game and a separate computer to stream. Uh, it really delivers for the gamer um, regardless of what they want to do. Okay. Uh, some question about Vega. Um, it launched uh, more expensive uh, than announced. Uh, do you know why? We believe that uh, Vega is a very e extremely powerful card. Um, it's a, a great moment, I think, for the whole industry to have um, a new entry into the enthusiast space. Um, the overwhelming demand for the product um, really led to, um, you know, sales flying through and we're working really hard to make sure that we replenish the supply uh, for the product and encouraging our, our partners to bring the prices close to our uh, announced uh, pricing for the product. Uh, has the mining boom still effect on Vega or just the uh, Polaris uh, GPUs? Uh, we really want to focus on the gamer, right? We want to deliver that value to the gamer uh, and we've constructed it so that we have a lot more value, whether it's uh, games or um, content or even platform options to go and deliver that story out. Um, so that's where our focus is. Um, we know that there are other factors in the industry, but we're really focused on uh, driving a great solution to, to gamers. Some looking in the future. Um, what about the RX uh, 580? Uh, will it be, when will it be cheaper at all? Uh, we, uh, again, are trying to drive as much product in the market as possible, and we want to make sure that there's inventory so that our partners can uh, deliver the product you know, at our suggested prices. Okay. Um, another question about the performance. A colleague of me uh, told me uh, that it's performing very well uh, in games uh, with a CPU limit. So it's uh, better uh, in a weak uh, CPU. Can you confirm this, or do you have any experience about that? For what card? Well, uh, for the gaming performance of the Vega uh, with the CPU Vega. Uh, we believe the Vega gaming performance is, is excellent. Um, and I think we've, we've shown, and many reviewers have shown, that it performs extremely well and is very competitive with uh, other enthusiast gaming cards that are out there in the market.